So as we know, the image tag is an inline tag, which means it flows with the text in a paragraph. And so here we have a paragraph with an image tag in it, and the image tag is at the beginning of the paragraph. And then we have some text and the close of the paragraph. So we see it displayed in the browser down here. We have something different that we're not used to. The text is actually flowing around the image. So if I bring this in and watch the text wrap, see it wraps there next to the image. And then when it gets past the end of the image, it wraps around the image. That's not what we have seen in the past. The way this is accomplished is with this align equals left attribute. And that makes the image float to the left side of the text. You can change it to align equals right, and it'll float to the right side of the text. We'll save that and reload. And there are now the image is floating to the right. Go ahead and change it back to left for our demonstration purposes and reload it. Another attribute here that you may not have seen before is the H space attribute. And what this does is it provides this horizontal space on either side of the image. You see there's 10 pixels on the right and there's 10 pixels on the left. If I make this a zero, get in there and make that a zero, go ahead and save and reload, you'll see that the text now wraps very closely to the image. It's right up against the image. There's no space there anymore because I made the space zero. So I'm gonna go ahead and make the space back to a one, zero for 10. And this makes 10 pixels on either side. You'll see that the text will move away from the image 10 pixels, but also the image will move over 10 pixels from the left margin as well. Reload, we'll see that. That's because this H space equals 10, it makes 10 pixels on either side of the image, left and right. And you can use V space for vertical space as well. That is the image tag we used in a floating mode. This align equals left or align equals right makes the image float to one side or the other of the text and makes the text wrap around it.